M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So I'm going to show you about this on the 8900, which I haven't got. I've got the 7900, and I'll do a demo at the end. About this thing that they brought out, Yesu brought out a few years ago, called the Auto Range Transponder System. So what it does, it sends out a DCS code uh, to another radio. And when you're in range, it tells you you're in range. And when you're out of range, it tells you you're out of range. It's pretty, it's that simple. So you do need to set the DCS code to be the same on each of the radios that are talking to each other. So the sort of, uh, the sort of C4FM version of this is DGID. So I just thought I'd show you the settings for your 8900 and then I'll do the video on my 7900. So here's your, set your 8900 and other radios to the same DCS code number. Now the, the way you do this is Go to, let's just look at the menu here. Let's get the right page. Menu, looks like it's menu number 40. So press and set key momentarily to enter set menu. Rotate the dial knob to menu 40. Press the main dial knob momentarily and then rotate the dial knob until DCS appears on the display. This activates the encoder. Once you've done this, you just need to select the correct number. So now press the, ma the main dial momentarily, then rotate the main dial knob to select menu 10. Press the main dial knob momentarily to enable the adjustment of the DCS code, then rotate the main dial knob to select the desired DCS code, a three digit number, I'm using 032. When you have made your selections, press and hold the main dial knob for half a second to save a new setting and exit normal operation. Okay. So then, hold, I'm just not sure I've already said this, but we'll say it again. Then hold, press the set menu key momentarily to enter set mode. Then rotate the dial knob to menu 3, ARTS. Press the dial knob momentarily, then rotate the dial knob to select the desired ARTS beep option. The available options are in range. The beeps are issued only when the radio first confirms that you are within range, but does not reconfirm with beeps thereafter. Always, every time a polling station, a polling transmission is received from the other station, the alerts beep will be heard. And then press the main dial knob momentarily. Out ring is displayed on the LCD. Arts operation has now commenced. So you just tap it momentarily. And then you can choose the pulsing time. Here it's every 25 seconds. I'm not sure if you can change that to 15 like you can on mine. So it starts to pulse and sends out a DCS. And what I've noticed is that when a radio talks back to it, and I tested it with my FT70 as you will see, when it talks back to it, it says in range. If I turn off the other radio and the Yesu FT8900 is pulsing and it's not um, receiving anything, then it will say that you are out of range. So that's the whole way this ARTS works. So give it a go. Wait, watch the rest of my video. Bye for now. I'll show you how it's done on the 7900. We'll come out of it all completely. So first thing you do is set your DCS code. So we go hold down band and it's different on the 8900. DCS code, press it again and look, DCS, we can turn the knob. 32 come out of that now to put it into the on mode you have to hold down ARTS and it will start pulsing and there are settings there where you can change it to uh, 15 or 25 seconds but anyway to make it just for testing purposes work on my FT70 I've just put the FT70 into DCS mode so all you do is just go um, F tone and then when you're choosing the tone you're just choosing DCS then, the t then when you're in DCS if you go F6 it just allows you to um, choose the number, so you go F, no different than setting CTSS tone frequency, 6, and look, these, we chose 32, so that's fine. So right now, if we come out of that, if we transmit on the, it will automatically transmit, or we can use the PTT, I'm using this quite nifty Bluetooth PTT, actually, which is pretty good, it has a Bluetooth module, but anyway, uh, key up. And you can see we're being received. Now, this isn't an ARTS radio, so you're not going to get any messages. But on this one, you are. So if I key, it says in, ra in range, that says. So that's telling me that I'm in range. And don't forget, I could do that. As long as I can reach the other station with the same DCS number, it's going to say in range. Now, what ends up happening is that if it doesn't get a reply, because they do talk to each other, 
when, it, when they're both turned on to ARTS, um, it would, in a minute, this is going to say out of range, because it's going to say, well, I'm not receiving you. So I'm now going to let you know and give you a beep that you're out of range. And there are beep settings on this radio. It's hold down, set, then number two is beep, and then you've got in range, always, or, or you can just turn it off. So it'll beep when you're in range. So there you are. So you, you, I've given you uh, some information on the 8900. Give it a go and uh, get a friend to dig out their ARTS radio and test it with you. Bye for now. Please uh, remember to like and subscribe if you're finding this fun. All the best.